Well, the city of Columbus's top doc takes the lead on helping to address and assure the public of how to get healthy and stay healthy. That could be anything from warnings about tobacco use and gun violence to encouraging vaccinations and safe sex. Tonight, only on 10 TV, Dr. Myshika Roberts is talking with 10 TV's Tracy Townsend about a new health mission, and this one is personal. Most people, if not everyone, has no idea that I'm living with this disease. Columbus Public Health Commissioner Mashika Roberts is talking about living with multiple sclerosis. My last day was January 12th. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. No other symptoms have come back from that? No. Dr. Roberts was diagnosed nearly 24 years ago during her own medical training. She now gets an infusion every six months here at Ohio Health Riverside Methodist Hospital for the neurological disease where the insulating covers of nerve cells in the brain and spinal cord are damaged. So when we calm those down, then we don't see that new damage or new inflammation and that prevents them from having more problems, problems with walking or thinking. Um, you know, the, the problems are really endless that could occur when you damage the brain and spine and MS. Ohio health neurologist Jacqueline Nicholas leads the commissioner's treatment team. How far has she come? So she's come a long way. So her disease onset early, and I think the work that she's done, I hope that other people will see that and other patients who are diagnosed and really take comfort in the fact that they can do well. Research from the National Multiple Sclerosis Society reveals more black people are diagnosed with the condition than previously thought, and it affects them differently than it does white people. Blacks are underrepresented in the research, and scientists are finding they have more aggressive progression and greater disability. Roberts also manages the condition with exercise, the support of her family, friends, and coworkers, and science. The science is what has me sitting here talking to you today without any handicaps. It's science. Um, it's all science. A message that supports her push for equity and access to quality health care for all, which the health commissioner championed, especially during the COVID pandemic, as she encouraged masking and vaccinations. Particularly African-Americans who are reluctant to get a diagnosis like multiple sclerosis because they're fearful of what that means for their life. The commissioner says she felt compelled to sit down with me to share this story as living proof of what's possible for everyone and not only when the patient is a physician. It doesn't change that you have to be your own advocate and you have to listen to your body and know when something's not right, to ask a question, to seek advice, and to follow the doctor's guidance. Dr. Roberts says her advice is for everyone with any kind of diagnosis. She's going to continue her work leading Columbus Public Health, and she was also appointed to the CDC Foundation, where she will help with mobilizing private sector and philanthropic partners to support the CDC's critical health protection mission. I'm Tracy Townsend, 10TV News.